Recent firmware update brings important new features to Cineview Master 4K. Now, your device will support drop frame frame rates, and you'll be able to select different no signal picture on the RX. Plus, numerous performance improvements compared to early release firmware that comes with the device. You can update the TX wired or wireless. Make sure your TX and RX's battery is above 50%. For wireless update, please first use the app to download the latest firmware package when connected to the internet with your regular home or office Wi-Fi. And once the download completes, you can follow the instructions, check the Wi-Fi name of the transmitter you wish to update, switch connection to its dedicated 5 GHz Wi-Fi network, then upload the package for update. If you're updating the TX wired, then please use a USB-C cable to connect your device to the transmitter. You don't have to switch Wi-Fi connections, just simply download the firmware and transfer the firmware package through USB connection. It will take about one minute for the device to perform internal firmware update. Once the transmitter is updated, the paired RX will show up an update prompt. Choose yes, and it will automatically sync firmware package and update. Now, your device will support drop free frame rates like 59.94, 29.97, and 23.976. On update and receivers, there will be a new option on AV info page. You can adjust the no signal picture right here. Choose between Axon logo, color stripes, blue, and black backgrounds. When the signal is down or when there is no input, your selected image will be shown on the screen. The app update to accommodate the new firmware also adds the feature of adjusting LUT opacity. We hope that this update can make Cineview Master 4K more helpful on set in your production. See you next time.